First of all, I would emphasize the idea of communication and exchanging new ideas, which is definitely um, available um, and, and realized at the VU campus. So, for instance, we don't have those tiny institutes anymore, but we have whole department buildings, which means that uh, there is a more there's a there's a more open um, way of communicating, meeting each other. So they have they all have kitchens where they can meet and they can sit and they can talk. So this is really um, an asset of the new campus, also highly appreciated by faculty members. You also have to meet in the central area of the campus, so you you can't. Uh, arrive by car and take the elevator up to the department building. You always have to show up in the central place, so you really have to meet each other. This is also this is also a, a kind of a mindset I, I I think is important for a university to meet each other, to exchange ideas, to communicate with each other. So this is really a spirit of the new campus, and this of course is also true for our internationalization strategy. So we find uh, um, our international uh, partners at universities who are very interested in, for instance, um, organizing their annual events at VU because they really perceive the campus as a modern, as an open, as a diverse and international uh, uh, campus. So this helps a lot in terms of building new and new international um, uh, connections and partnerships. On the other side, I would not go so far and say that the, the, it's the only issue faculty and, let's say, research excellence is, is interested in. So if I, for instance, are uh, negotiating contracts with uh, new professors, they always had first a look to the faculty members. So whom will I meet here? Who will be my colleagues? And uh, our, our triple accreditation uh, is very important for them as a sign of the, of the excellence of our work. But, of course, sitting here, having a look uh, around, they al also would mention the nice campus and it would be an additional asset for people to come and work or study here. To be honest, I think it's better than I expected because we were really skeptical about this huge project um, and also defining, um, you know, a time schedule which was really tough, but we made it. So we managed to stay within the budget and the time schedule. So this is really, I think, a big success of uh, all the VU uh, people taking care and, and being involved in the whole process. So I'm really happy, but of course, uh, it's an ongoing process. So as I said, campus life is not, with, it's not a kind of, you know, you don't go through a checklist and say, well, we've done a task accomplished, everything is fine. We have um, constantly rethink uh, processes, we have to optimize processes, we have to learn how, uh, for instance, to deal with uh, professional event management and all these kind of things. These are tasks um, stemming from uh, the opportunities uh, of the new campus, but those have not been originally part of the plan uh, when we started to design and think over the new campus. So these things came up and now we have to deal with this. It's a, a good opportunity and we have to make um, success out of these opportunities we have.